These are three facts you probably didn't know about the Leaning Tower of Pisa. My name is Michel and a few weeks ago I visited the Leaning Tower of Pisa in Italy. Now of course I did some research beforehand and I found out three amazing facts that I bet you didn't know about. Number one. It took almost 200 years to build the tower. Construction started almost 900 years ago and the tower has been leaning ever since. Because of war and political conflict in the area, construction of it was halted a few times. Now the frequent delays allowed the soil to settle, which inadvertently saved the structure. The soil in this area of Italy is quite unstable and the word Pisa in ancient Greek actually means marshy land. Coincidentally, that same soil makes it earthquake proof because it absorbs all the tremors. Modern research has shown that if it was built in one go, there probably wouldn't be a Tower of Pisa today. Number two. It was almost completely destroyed in the Second World War. The Americans who were liberating Italy heard rumors that the Germans were using it as a lookout. They sent Sergeant Wechstein to investigate and call down artillery fire if that was the case. But when Wechstein was observing the tower, he was so mesmerized by its beauty that he couldn't make the call, thus sparing it from utter destruction. Number three. The Leaning Tower of Pisa isn't just a normal tower. It's actually a belfry or bell tower belonging to the cathedral right next to it. The tower hosts seven bells, representing the seven musical tones. Every bell has its own name. The biggest one is the Assunta's bell, which weighs almost 8,000 pounds. The others are named Crocifisso, San Ranieri, Talpozzo, Pascareccia, Terza and Verspruccio. The San Ranieri bell associated with the note D was called Justice or Traitor Bell because it rang every time a traitor was condemned to death. In the past, every bell was associated with a liturgical moment. Pascareccia, for example, was rang during Easter time. Today, you can hear the bells before every mass and at midday. Did you know that the world famous Leaning Tower of Pisa could have actually been straight? An international team of engineers has begun work on Italy's Leaning Tower of Pisa. The most recent and most successful operation ended in 2001. You can still see some of the anchors of that operation today. The architects reduced the tower's tilt by about 10%. Enough to stabilize it so it doesn't fall, but not enough that people would notice. They left it leaning because they feared a lot of people would be angry if the famous Leaning Tower of Pisa suddenly became the Tower of Pisa. This way, the tower is stable and everyone is happy. Thanks for watching today's video about the Tower of Pisa. Um, if you're watching this quite a bit into the future, you can probably already go ahead and watch all our other Italy content. If not, stay tuned and I'll see you next time.